everybody's sense of taste and smell is different. But what about those who share the same genes? The Monell Center studies identical twins beyond just genetics to determine the impact on factors like taste and smell. The type of work that I do is looking at the genetics of liking and taste. So we're really interested in why people like the things that they do. And the tool that we use for that is genetics, and particularly we study human twins. We have genetically identical twins, and then we have these non-identical twins. But what happens is they both grow up living in the same home. And so there might be similarities for those reasons, or it could be that they're similar because they're genetically similar. And so we're able, by looking at the differences between these types of twins, to see how much has to do with growing up in the same home. Our twin research helps us divide up the pie, right? So we know that we are who we are based on what happens to us, our environment, and who we are genetically. And so the twin research helps us to understand the proportions of those things. And that's important because, for instance, if you know that your dislike of vegetables, like some bitter vegetables, is 100% genetic, right? You, they just taste very bitter to you. That's gonna change how we might wanna make recommendations, right? So just like if I was your dietitian and you had lactose intolerance, I'm not gonna be pushing milk on you, right? And so if we know more about the genetic causes, then that'll help us when we're making recommendations. We won't be trying to make people eat stuff that they absolutely legitimately find to be very bitter. You know, as a parent myself, I agonized over feeding my children healthy, nutritious meals, low in sugar, all of those things. But what we're seeing is twins who grew up in high sugar or low sugar homes are not necessarily very influenced by that, that the genetics tends to be a stronger driver than that shared experience. And then there's the shared experience that the twins live in the same home, they eat the same food prepared by their parents and so forth. And then there's those individual experiences. So even the genetically identical twins are different due to their individual experiences. Everybody's very different in their sense of taste and smell. So those are the things we've been learning through our twin research.